what up guys you must have noticed lots of this uh, kind of nfts in your in your avive application and you don't really know how it get there well this is your geo stamp that shows that you are really active on this uh, application i'll be giving you more details of how it gets there and more things you need to know in this video and apart from that i'll be showing you how you can add the avive token to your metamask your trust wallet and also your okx wallet by using your contract address with the contract address of avive coin so if you're interested in everything i just mentioned right here right now you need to stick to this video till the end all right guys so the geo stamp is a proof that you've been very you've been participating in the test net you know we are actually on the test net stage right now so a proof that you have participated in the test net and also you are very active on the application in this project and each time you tr you claim your coin that's each time you click on claim to in order for you to claim your avive coin one of these geostamp is being generated that is why you keep seeing it increasing on your balance and it's going to adding up to your scores for the kyc so you have to make sure you are clicking on the claim button every hour in order for you to generate more of the geo stamp because it's going to be adding up to your scores for the result of your kyc because they are still going to evaluate your kyc and see how active you are in this project before you will be able to receive your coin so you have to make sure you are claiming your avive coin every hour so each time you claim your avive coin one of these nfts one of these geo stamp nfts are being generated for you so guys that is just a simple thing why simple reason why you can see this thing in your application here now quickly let me show you how you can add up avive coin to your metamask wallet using the contract address let's go so in order for you to add your avive coin to be appearing on your metamask wallet this way you will need to get the contract address that's the first thing so the contract address i'll leave it in the description of this video go down there you click on it you can copy it from there and you come into your metamask wallet so once you come come over to the wallet the next thing you should do is to make sure you are changing your network this network must be on arbitron one network so you make sure this is the right network you are using then the next thing you do here is to click on import token you can see import token over here this is it import token click on it once you click on it it's going to take you to where you are going to be pasting your contract address so all we need to do here is to paste the contract address that we copied over here uh, paste okay then just uh, maybe you click here a few minutes wait you can see it has already been it has already appeared as arrive and uh, the token decimal is 18 so all i need to do now is to click on import so click on import and you're going to see your token is going to be on your balance so you can see it over here now a vibe coin has been has been added to my metamask wallet it's as simple as that now quickly let's add it to the trust wallet for those of you that want to use trust wallet this is how you're going to do it let's go to the trust wallet and i'll show you how to do that quickly once you're in your trust wallet this way you still need your contract address so you just have to copy the contract address and you have to come over here you click on this top right corner where you can see the plus sign click on it and it will take you to where you can add up your uh, your coin so what you, all you need to do now is to click on uh, this this right up that says didn't see your crypto import so you click on it all right so over here you are you are still going to change your network again because i can see here it's in ethereum you have to change it again then you click on it and uh choose your ethereum arbitron here over here okay good so we are going to be pasting the contract address over here you paste it here and you just wait few seconds it's going to come all right you can see it has the symbol and the name everything has just appeared so all you need to do now is to click on import so let's import it and we're going to see it on our uh, trust wallet so that is it you can see avive has been added to our trust wallet now let's head over to the okx wallet i'll be showing you how to do that over there. before we head over there if you like what i'm showing you in this video please give this video a thumbs up like this video it's an appreciation from you and a big motivation for me to keep doing more stuff like this for you so guys like this video and subscribe if you've not yet subscribed quickly now let's go to the okx wallet once you get to your okx wallet the first thing you should do is uh in case you are not yet on the wallet section you have to make sure you are on the wallet not the exchange you have to take take note of that there is difference between the exchange and the wallet so make sure you are on the wallet not on the exchange so you click on it so you're going to get to a page looking like this now in order for you to add 
the avive coin to your wallet over here all you need to do is to click on manage crypto that you can see down here this place that you can see manage crypto click on it and once you click on it it's going to take you to where you can add your contract address and you are going to be able to add the token to the wallet automatically so i'll show you all that right here right now okay good now once you get here what you need to do is to click over here you can see where it's written custom crypto or you just click on this arrow so it will take you to where you can customize your you can import when crypto you want to import all right so you have to change this to uh, the wallet uh, to the network you want to change it to so you have to change it to the network you need okay which is arbitron one you click on it then all you need to do is to paste the contract address in this box over here paste it and you will see the symbol and the decimal point will appear after few seconds okay let's just go this way all right you can see now all you need to do is to click on confirm and once you click on confirm you will see the archive coin in your wallet let's do that quickly all right all right so here we are you can see it at the bottom here archive coin has been added to our wallet it has been added to my arbitron wallet you can see it over here this is my wallet this is my arrive coin on my wallet right here it's as simple as that and after doing this you can be able to transact your arrive coin i transfer it from metamask to your okx to trust wallet you can be able to transact it you can transfer and do anything with it after you add all the after adding the coin to every one of these wallets so guys it's as simple as that now OKX is a very good plan. It's a very good trading app that I do use often. I use it to trade my cryptocurrencies. I buy, I sell, I do so many things with uh, with uh, OKX. And in case you don't have it and you're interested, you can go to the description of this video. You'll get the link there. Click on it to sign up and make sure you do your verifications in order for you to be able to transact with the application. So there are lots of crypto that you can get on the OKX application too all right so guys that's all for this video if you like what i showed you in this video please give this video a thumbs up and if this is your first time on my youtube channel go ahead smash the subscribe button click on the notification bell sign so you get notified each time i upload a brand new update so guys i'll see you guys again in my next video bye